ome wa amani tukiliinua jina lako tukikutukuza tukisema wewe ni Mungu na baina yako hakuna mwingine wewe ulipenda ukatumba na sura yako na mfano wako mfaume na ukafanya kazi siku sita na ukampumzika siku ya saba ndipo saa tutakuabudu tukakuinue tukakutolee sifa na shukurani bwana tuko mbele zako mfaume wa amani tunanyenyekea Yesu Kristo tukiomba ukachunguze mafikiria yetu roho zetu nafsi zetu matendo yetu chochote tunatenda tukiwa hapa duniani maana macho yako inaangalia mema na mabaya yanayotendwa na watu duniani na kwa sababu tunakaa kwa hii dunia iliyo na dhambi na shetani na maroho mabaya tunaweza kuwa tumekukosea kwa njia moja ama kwa ingine bila kujua tumekuja kuungama dhambi zetu atia zote na makosa tunaweza kuwa tumetenda kinyume na wewe tunaomba utusamehe bwana usamehe masigara ya hapa na chochote kinaweza na jisi kanisa watu wako ministry na kila kitu tuna kilahani katika jina la Yesu Kristo tunachukia shetani tunachukia dhambi tunachukia uovu tunachukia laana tunachukia unachochukia katika jina la Yesu Kristo Bwana wewe unatuomba una unatarajia tukisimama mbele zako tuwe tunakubalika mbele ya macha yako tunaomba kibali kutoka kwako baba yetu na Mungu wetu uliyetupenda ukatoa mwanao wa pekee ili afe kwa ajili yetu yeyote amwaminie asipotee mbali apate uzima wa milele ninaomba kama kuna mtu atakuja na ajaokoka bwana ukamuongeleshe kupitia watumishi wako na roho wako mtakatifu zote tuwe tumeokoka tuwe warithi wa mbingu turithi inchi na mbingu tukiwa wana wao tunasema ni asanti kwa kuwa ulituonekania siku ya kwanza na jana siku ya pili na tunajua leo utatenda maajabu na makuu ishara na miujiza maana matarajio yetu iko kwako mfaume wa amani tunaomba na tunajua shetani anaendanga kwa wate ule bila kukaribishwa na kama kuna yoyote kutoka kusimu kutoka kwa shetani kutoka kwa adui tunaikemea sasa katika jina la Yesu Kristo tunafunga mapepo yote ya kutuma na kurushwa tunayaangamiza sasa katika jina la Yesu Kristo tunatangazia shetani na ufaume wake na dhambi zake na maroho zake katika jina la Yesu Kristo ya kuwa ana nguvu ana uweza ana mamlaka ana ruhusa ana nafasi kwa maisha yetu kwa huu ushirika kwa hili kanisa kwa hii ministry na yoyote akwapa sasa na hata milele katika jina la Kristo baba tukiomba dada zetu na ndugu zetu wanaojipanga kuja bwana tunakataa vizuizi vyote tukikataa pingamizi zote tukikataa vifungo zote katika jina la Yesu Kristo na wafungua bwana ukawapatie basfea ukawapatie nguvu ukawapatie uweza ukawapatie hata msisimko ukawaweke nguvu ukawaweke amani uwapatie furaha wote wamekusudia kuja na wengine bwana uwalete hata wale wanapitia kwa hii njia bila kujua kama kuna kanisa 
wakisoma kibao waingie na wale wanataka kuabudu na wajui ni wapi bwana tunawaita kutoka mashariki kutoka magharibi kutoka kaskazini kutoka kusini kapa katikati magandara almighty god island in the name of jesus christ mfaume tunasema kama musa alisema bila wewe atuwezi toka mali hapa na hata sasa tutaki kuanza bila wewe tunakukaribisha mungu baba mwana na roho mtakatifu ukashuke ukachukue usukani utuongoze chochote tutafanya hapa hiwe tumefanya kwa kusudi lako kwa uweza wako kwa nguvu zako kwa njia zako kwa uongozi wako na mfaume tukiona tumemaliza ibada za leo sifa zote heshima na utukufu tutakupatia maana ni zako na ni kwa jina la Yesu Kristo aliye bwana na mwokozi wa maisha yetu tunaomba na kusema
tunakushukuru tunakuinua tunakubariki na tunakutukuza asante kwa kutupokea mili yetu roho zetu sauti zetu na hata midomo yetu tunasema ni asante mfaume asante kwa sababu tuko tayari kuketi tusikie kutoka kwako mfaume uishie milele tuko na kiu na tuna njaa ya neno lako tunaomba mtumishi wako ulie mpaka na ukamteua na ukamchagua tulishe leo afungue mdomo bwana ukaweke neno lako ndani yake akaongee mahusia yako kwa kupitia kwa neno lako ukatubariki tukafuatwe na ishara miunjiza namba kuu na ni kwa jina la Yesu Kristo tunaomba na kuamini tukiwa tumesimama tu naomba tuunganishe mikono yetu tukaribishe mtu mbili wa kwanza wa leo na sio mwingine ni mtoto wetu ni mzee wa hii kanisa ni mchungaji wa hii kanisa wengine wanaweza kuwa wamjui lakini anaitwa David Waswa makofi shangwe na vigelegele Haleluya. Basi tushangilie Yesu let us make a joyful night in the house of the Lord. Shangilie Yesu. Pika ndiru. Shangilie Yesu kwa makofi. Haleluya. Haleluya. Amen. 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 Tunashangilia Mungu wetu because he has arisen. Amefufuka. Kwa hivyo kama amefufuka hata sisi tumefufuka mioyo yetu imefufuka shangilia Yesu Haleluya Haleluya Pika duru Haleluya Yes Yes there is power there is power here there is power here the power is here Bwana asifiwe sana Haleluya kwa hivyo Ah uh,
juu hapo huko wewe sienda na gari unaenda na punda wewe niambie sasa kama huko alafu niambiwa ati hapa watu tuwalishe sasa tutatoka huko tutembee paka pungoma tukose mikati tuende siku paka kaapu kisumu ndio tunavute mikati tutafika huko saa ngapi na turuti tulishe watu haleluya sasa mlipuka ikakucha yesu akawaambia sasa usiwe na wasiwasi john don't be afraid wana asifiwe sana akawaambia sasa ambia watu wakae chini alafu leta hiyo mikati leta hiyo mikati kwangu Yesu akamletea hiyo mikati wakaleta hiyo samaki akapariki he placed them and then he started akawaambia akawapea and then muelishe watu bwana asifiwe sana they immediately he prayed and he gave the disciples and then their eyes opened ndio akamchua huyu mtu ni nani bwana asifiwe sana haleluya because sasa waje tuseme hivi wewe pewe mikati mbili hapa huyu mmoja mwingine hapa mmoja mwingine mikati mbili pale bwana asifiwe sana nataka muelewe hii kitu vizuri bwana asifiwe alafu bishop anakuambia hebu anza ku kuenza kupea watu si iko sliced bread si iko sliced bread anza kupea watu anza kupea watu kwa nini wewe usimuuliza na sasa bishop hata hii mkate haitafika pale haitafika si ni ukweli e, haitafika lakini when jesus prayed alipo alipoomba na akamwambia peana wanafunzi basi these people they open their eyes open wakamuchua ai na huyu ni nani basi walipofunguka macho wakaendelea tu therefore asubuhi ya leo nimekuja ya kwamba nimekuja with the good news have come with the good news to tell you ya kwamba asubuhi ya leo wewe unaenda kumchua Yesu ni nani wewe unaenda kumchua Yesu ni nani kwa maisha yako aliyepatilisha hii hali bwana asifiwe sana wanafunzi imagine the disciples just like the just like here pastors tuko hapa ye bishop anakuambia fanya hivi unasema bishop hata wewe unaona hii haiwezi gani hao watu ni wengi hii chakula itatosha hii mikati haitatosha bwana asifiwe sana the disciples lakini yesu akasema namna gani uwapatie haleluya asubuhi ya leo nimekuja na uchumbe ya kwamba hakuna hali ambayo yesu hawezi kupatilisha maisha yako inaenda kupatilika haleluya pika nduru kwa yesu Yes, hakuna hali ambayo haiwezi kupatilika. There is no situation which cannot change in your life. Bwana asifiwe sana. Wanafunzi wa Yesu wakasema haiwezekani hii. Bwana asifiwe sana. Nataka kukuja kwa maisha yako. Allow me to come in your life, my brother, my sister. Allow me to come in your life this morning. Kuna hali there is a situation in your life unaangalia hivi unaona hii haiwezekani this morning kupitia kwa washa hii na kupitia kwa madhabahu hii na kupitia kwa watumishi wa Mungu pamoja na mimi hiyo hali inaenda kupatilika hiyo hali inapatilika leo hauwezi kutoka hapa bila ulikuja leo leo inaenda kuisha leo inaenda kupatilika bwana asifiwe sana amen wakasema haiwezekani na ni kweli ukiangalia haingewezekana bwana asifiwe sana yes okay bila nimesema enda ni kama unatoka moyale nini unatoka marisapi tu unaenda unakaribia moyale uingie ndani namna hii ni kama unaenda sasa mara si ndio huko rough road huko unakuwa na four wheel drive car ndio ende hata wise utapita kinyesha utapita sasa sehemu kama hiyo kweli kabisa hata ukiangalia tuna hii macho si unaona hapa mkate haipatikani kitu chochote haipatikani ukitafuta hata hoteli mzuri hakuna We utalala tu mahali utalala bwana asifiwe sana yes kwa macho ya wana, macho ya ma, macho ya wanafusi iliwe ilionekana haitawezekana lakini Yesu because he's the creator of everything bwana asifiwe sana Yesu ndiyo the creator haleluya wewe unaona wakati anaongea na mafarisayo 
with the Pharisees. Anasema na gani? Before Moses, I was. Before Abraham, I was. Meaning, before even creation, he was there. Therefore, when he is telling the disciples that it is possible, tell these people to sit down. They are going to eat. Wanafuzi wa kuona. Nataka suwi ya leo. My friend, nataka suwi ya leo. Allow me to come in your life. And tell you after this workshop, this morning, you will receive a miracle in the name of Jesus. There is nothing impossible before God. Everything is impossible. Everything is possible. There is nothing impossible. One as if he were. Nataka kuku challenge. Allow me to challenge you. We on a sema. I had a pastor in Gumusan. Dio, Ningumusan. Kwa macho yako. Lakini before God, everything is possible. Before God, everything is possible. Naomba, it is my prayer and my plea that everyone here, as we are leo, utapokea muchisa. Kuna kitu weo naomba mungu wa kutende. There is something you have been praying for. Hata wakatu umekucha hapa hivi. Mimi huwa nasema na muna hii. Hata kama tumeokoka, we are saved. We are saved. We speak in tongues. Lakini vile tatu kuhubiri wa chana hapa. We need to be rich. We need to have everything. Ama na muna gani? Yes, we need to have everything. Kwa hivyo asibui ya leo, nataka wewe nduku yangu. Weo naomba nini? In your life, what is that situation? Ile na kufanya wewe, wewe mama, wewe my sister, wewe brother yang. What is that situation which makes you look like he? Hai wese gani? Asibui ya leo, ni mekucha kukuambia hivi. I've come to encourage you that everything is possible before God in the name of Jesus. Nataka kila mmocha apoke muchisa wake. Kila mmocha wake. Awe mtoto, awe mse, awe nani, everything is possible. Asubuhi ya leo, hauwezi kucha hii workshop na uruti vile ulikucha. Hasha, mimi nimekata, hata weo kikupali, mimi nimekata. Uwezi kaa hapa, uende nyumbani, the same way you came. I refuse that in the name of Jesus, everyone will receive a miracle. Mambo inaenda kutendeka hapa. Hallelujah. Pokea hiyo mochisa. Receive that miracle. Receive it. Ni nini weo naombea? Wewe mama. Nataka ni kucha kwa maisha yako. Allow me to come. Allow me to come. Nataka ni kucha kwa maisha yako. Wewe mama. Usiseme haiwezekani. Inawezekana. Wana asifuwe sana. Yes. Inawezekana. Sia tukuna watu wengine wamepikwa rapa stambu ya kuesa na si we wamepikwa rapa stambu haita wesekana. There is nothing like that. Wana asifuwe sana. Mimi ni mesaliwa ushako, sisaliwa hapa town. Wana asifuwe sana. Wewe kwa hiyo boma. Wewe unaona hiyo area ati kuna wadosi, kuna matachiri, kuna watu wamechenga nyumba kubwa. Kwa nini wewe pio sichenge nyumba kubwa? Kwa nini mutoto yako, mumocha wawili, wasiinuke, wana asifiwe. Hallelujah! Yes! Paka watoto wako wainuke. Hata wachuku wako wainuke. Usao wako wainuke. Wakiesabu watu kwa hiyo area. Wadosi. Hata wewe pia unaesabuliwa hapo. Wana asifiwe sana. Sio hawa wanaesabuliwa na wewe atu esabuliwi hapana. Ama na muna gani? Uyu mutoshi hakitoka main road ya kiingia ndani na muna hee. Anatakana kiingia naona nyumba ingina hapa kubwa anauliza ni ya nani? Ni ya mtoto wa fulani. Na hiyo ni papa yaki. Wana asifiwe. Sia anapita tu na muna hii. Hapana. Ni mekata hiyo. Ni mekata. I refuse. In the name of Jesus. Wana asifiwe sana. Kila mmocha atapokea muchisa. Wanafuzi wakasema haiwezi. Kani mimi ni mekucha kukuambia. My brother, my sister. Everything is possible before God. In the name of Jesus. Wana asifiwe sana. Sio sisi tuliumbwa ati hatuta wesa, ati wale ndiyo watawesa. Hakuna kitu kama cha hiyo. Wana asifiwe sana. There is no situation. Wana asifiwe sana. Ndiyo mimi na malisia. 
I preach very little hours. Nataka kumalishia. Nataka wewe uone ni kitu gani hiyo inakusumbua wewe. Imekusumbua miaka. Imekusumbua miaka. Hata kama walisema nini ati social mroka unajua huyu hata wesa. Asubuhi ya leo nimekuja kusema inawezekana it is possible. Huyo sosho tunaomba hapa leo hiyo uchawi inaisha ngofu. Haleluya. Yes, wana asifiwe sana. Everything is possible before God. Masi unataka kuimba paka US. Pokea hiyo. Wewe imba paka US huko. Uende upate matola. Ndio anaweza kunitumia tola tano tu sitaki mingi. Haleluya. Wana asifiwe. Yes, kila mmoja hapa nataka kila mmoja hapa yani i want i am pleading with you kila mmoja everyone when i will hand over the the, the, the mic to, to our bishop nataka niombe kila mmoja akuje hapa mapasta mtasongea msingira wa watu na maashas kila mtu paka atoke na mujisa leo hakuna kitu haiwezekani everything is possible ni uchanja wa shetani unakwambia hii haiwezekani nimeomba nimeomba sasa wewe unakaanga tu nimeomba nimeomba please keep on praying keep on praying today is your time today is your time today is your time receive every miracle receive every miracle Haleluya. Wewe branch branch church pastor. Mahali huko hapo kuna makanisa inakusingira. Huko na watu 20. Sasa unasema sasa nitakaje? Mekaa miezi sita na watu 20. Wacha nikuambie. Ile mlipuka inaenda kulipuka hapa siku ya leo. Hautaamini! Hautaamini! Haleluya. Unaenda kukucha kwa hii waka shop next year. A time like this utakuja utatoa ushuhuta. Utakuja utatuambia. Utakuja utasema kweli kabisa ilipuka. Haleluya. Because nothing is impossible before God. Bwana asifiwe sana. Hata kama wamesema nini? Hata kama ilisemekana namna gani? Bwana asifiwe sana. Jesus told the disciples, make these people sit down. Let them sit down. Wakati walikaa Yesu wakati aliomba these people wakafunguka macho wakamuona Bwana asifiwe sana Now Jesus was revealing his glory to the disciples Bwana asifiwe sana You remember in John chapter 2 Jesus was invited in a wedding in Cana Bwana asifiwe sana Now he was just seated as an ordinary man but when the time came because the mother knew this man or this boy ama mtoto wake na akaambia hao watu whatever he says do it na hata yeye hakuenda maneno mengi hata in fact hakuomba Jesus did not pray bwana asifiwe sana he only said put water in the jars alafu funika walipofunika walipofunika fungua hivi water had changed into wine na watu wakakunywa bwana asifiwe sana watu wakakunywa and the pipe says the wine was so good that even the master of the ceremony said hey, you have served the best wine since we started bwana asifiwe sana aisa sikuambie uende kunywa wine ah sikuambie eh jesus only changed water into wine haleluya bwana asifiwe sana kwa hivyo Asibuya leo paka situation yako your situation must change. Bwana asifiwe sana. Your situation must change. Your family must change. Even you, through you your your village, your society, ile area unatoka. Watu paka wakujue wewe. Haleluya. Kwa sababu asubuhi leo unaenda kupokea muuchisa na huo muuchisa unaenda kupatilisha familia yako watu wa kwenu hapa nyumbani wale majirani na wale wengine and the society this morning haleluya shangilia yesu basi weka tayari sasa nataka ufikirie nimekuja kwa maisha yako i have explained clearly to you ni nini hiyo wewe unataka? Ni nini hiyo wewe umekuwa ukiomba? Umekuja hii workshop yes, lakini unahitaji 
unataka Mungu akutetee ndio tumeokoka yes tunaenda yes tunatoa ndio tunalipa tax ya serikali yes lakini tunataka mingi tunataka muuchisa tunachaka Mungu atutendee saiti na saiti because the power is here bwana asifiwe sana Jesus did, did Jesus did all those things because there was power I'm feeling power here I am feeling power here ndipo sasa wakati naenda kuita sasa naenda ku hand over Michael wewe mwenyewe umekuwa ume decide decide already decide already wakati unakucha hapa nataka uende na muuchisa nataka uende na muuchisa nataka hiyo hali ipatilike katika china la Yesu nikisema ya kwamba there is nothing impossible before God in the name of Jesus Christ a time like this next wash next conference na wewe utakucha na ushuta hata kama hutashuhudia lakini itaonekana hata kuna watu watasema hata kutawa hata hata kutukia kuangalia tu you will see we shall see there is something has happened to you therefore i am finishing nataka niombe niseme hivi sasa as i finish It is my prayer my prayer my plea that my sister my brother this morning something has to change in your life something has to change in your life nataka niwaombe tu nyinyi vile umekaa hapo hivyo wewe tikiria what is that ni nini hiyo wewe umekuwa kiomba wanafunzi wakasema haiwezekani lakini Yesu akasema inawezekana because Jesus is the order of everything he is the creator of everything he was there before everything now Jesus was revealing his glory to his disciples Jesus this morning is revealing his glory to us sisi wote hapa nimewapea example mingi Yesu anataka kuchifunua kwako asubuhi ya leo ni nini hiyo wewe unaweza kusema nataka Mungu anifanyie hii kwa hivyo asubuhi ya leo mimi nikiunganisha imani yangu imani yangu my plea my prayer to you and bless the altar this altar i speak breakthrough i speak blessing i speak every blessing every miracle in your life receive every miracle receive every miracle you have been praying for receive that miracle receive it receive it receive it receive it so as a sign of outward show I'm handing over the mic to Bishop. Wakati wimbe taimbwa, ningependa wewe mwenyewe papa situ kwa roho yako na ukuje hapa na ukiruti unaruti umepepana in the name of Jesus Christ. Kwa hivyo ninawaombea mema, ninawaombea baraka. I wish you all the blessing. I wish you breakthrough. I wish you success throughout this convention. Every one of you asiende nyumbani bila muuchisha. Thank you very much. Asante sana kwa wakenu wetu. Most welcome. Karibuni sana. Ah, uh, karibuni sana. We value you so much and we uh, we appreciate you so much our visitors. Most welcome. Karibuni sana. Karibuni sana. Wacha tuwashangilie kwa makofi. Yes, 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 yes. Most welcome our visitors. Ah, uh, most welcome. Karibuni sana. Ah, uh, we were reading from We were reading from, from Matthew 14:15. Uh, there is a very beautiful story there concerning how Jesus had a crusade in a remote place. So Jesus went on doing a miracle and then he revealed his glory to the disciples. So most welcome we were finishing up. We were finishing up but when you go read Matthew 14:15. Thank you very much. Most welcome. Kwa hivyo mimi nimemalizia, nimeombea baraka, nimeombea ushindi. I pray breakthrough to every one of you and I've said, please, when the older girl will be gold here, just come. 
just come. I feel the presence of God here. I feel the presence of God. And I feel breakthrough to every one of you in any area you have been praying for. Any area you have been praying for, I feel breakthrough. Mimi ni naona upenyo. I see breakthrough in your life. Therefore, muparikiwe sana. Be blessed all. Now is the time. I invite my bishop to take over now and to continue. Thank you very much. Thank you for listening for me. Asandeni sana. Parikiweni sana. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Miracle waka. You are miracle waka. Come and do a miracle. A miracle today. Come and do a miracle, a miracle today. Miracle waka. I'm waiting for somebody to pray with. Miracle waka. Nangojia mutu anataka kuekelewa mikona. Come and do a miracle. Apoke uo mjiza kabisa. A miracle today.
we can take our seats as vessels of worship minister to the Lord for the great and powerful word that we have heard from the Lord through David Waswa. To begin, yes, my coffee. I'm a tender, I'm a tender, I'm a tender, I'm a tender. Na ataendelea kutenda. 